Oh, we got a solar advisory. Oh yeah, lots of activity up there, boy. Yeah, spot 30 on the south and 31 on the north is just about coming into Earth. 30 already is. Uh, 31, well, it's ex whatever that comet did, whatever it uh, put into the coronasphere, it's taken the coronasphere down. All kinds of unfusables. are uh, getting ejected. You can just see the activity brewing on uh, Sunspot 1131, I think it is. The one that's uh, in the Northern Hemisphere. So, um, I would say uh, solar, solar storm advisory for the whole next week. Fuck it, you guys are just gearing up to bomb the piss out of North Korea and Kim Jong-un. Oh, here we go. Maybe we're gonna get a shot. Just move over from that tree a little. <sighs> and what's probably gonna set them off is that big one that's just around the, uh, over the horizon now. Went over yesterday. Let's see if we can catch anything without burning out the old camera. And that's on manual. Oh, I see the dogs are getting rained on. So back to earth we go. <clears throat> Howdy guys. Yeah, uh, hey, before I, uh, the camera gets all reined in here. <coughs> all right, let's try this. Uh, yeah, so uh, Kim, what's... Uh, What's the fine for um, overflying your airspace, uttering death threats, and um, mass littering? I understand they dropped a couple of paper bombs over uh, Hanoi uh, a few days ago. They being um, the Obamni and the U.S. Air Force. Uh, I don't think they're scammed the uh, NATO contingent there yet. Uh, well, anyhow, I would, I would, um, I would get filing at the International World Courts. <sighs> You know, and there's no need to blow up that uh, that massive uh, U-238 uh, deposit in that volcano on the China Bora River there, and you know, <clears throat> make the hugest gold bomb that uh, the universe has ever seen, and let the cloud blow over China and Japan, so you can just walk in. You know, two three weeks later, when all that U-2 or, uh, AU, <clears throat> sorry, the camera's getting wet. When all that AU, <sighs> 298 deradiates. <sighs> uh, yeah, we know all about it. <clears throat> um, I told you Chicken Little left some eggs, didn't I? Yeah, he did. It did. Um, I don't know what they intend to do about it. Not my business, really. I'm just saying, you know, what's, uh, like, uh, Peter Sellers' Dr. Strangelove said in How I Love to Learn the Bomb, 1964 flick. Go see it if you haven't. Um, you can get it off of YouTube. Uh, hell, you can get it off of my playlists. Um, why didn't you tell us you had a doomsday bomb? It doesn't do much of a deterrence if nobody knows you have a doomsday bomb. Okay. <laughs> there you go, buddy. Hope I haven't, you know, pissed on your parade, uh, snatched your, your um, surprise line or whatever, but, you know, one must um, enforce the peace as one sees fit. Such as my primary function. Since, uh, since they kicked me out of the Chicken Little's toolbox. Yeah. 
Well, there you go. Last look. So, solar advisory. Anything to add to that before I short the camera out in the wet? In the radioactive wet? Yeah, I guess the Yanks are trying to nuke us again. Hey, I don't care. I'm already fucking nuked. So nuked and dead. I got so much uh, uranium oxide inside me, internalized, that escaped uh, when my <sighs> when my uh, appendix burst, and uh, the the uh, ascending colon rupture. That really, I mean, there wasn't even any point in taking an uh, X-ray or. Red X or whatever the hell it's called there that, you know, makes your cells stop growing and gives you 10 years. But your cells just kind of... Well, you ever seen a gray? The same kind of process. Where you shut off cell mitosis. <sighs> I'll even post the formula. Actually, no. I already did post it twice in the comments on um, uh, that English uh, Royal Chemistry channel there that Brady runs. You guys all know it because I've sent you all kinds of links to it every time they put a good one out. Or uh, the professor with the wild hair there comes out and teaches everybody about chemistry. Hey, anyhow, um, <clears throat> don't wipe your show yourselves off the face of the earth before the uh, before the show's done and. Um, Happy survivals to y'all. Well, what else can I say? Serve life. Follow the first meaning of life, which is survival for all living organisms as best you can. Never take a life needlessly and you'll at least um, have a clean conscience and be functioning in harmony when you're when you need to really call on your entire essence to survive another day. Like Bob sings in that tune about he who runs away to fight another day. And yeah, Bob Marley. I'm sure that's in the Bob Marley playlist. Maybe somebody can fish it up and put it in the comments. As I said, I don't have much more time for this uh, channel. But there's no reason why you guys can't help run it. You all have seen plenty of my examples of improvised networking, and I'm sure you all have your own one. You know, you've seen me come in and do this and that, right there in front of you, and, and comment, and oh, hey, right on, and you never did anything about it, so. And of course, Anyone that has a, a relevant uh, upload that they would like to video response, go for it. Alright, catch you later. There you go, there's your solar advisory. Heads up. I'm sure by the time this uploads uh, Monday morning, the, uh, the solar weather advisory will have been turned into an all out warning. It's not an incoming notice. And we are saturated to the hilt upstairs. The Holy Comforter is withdrawn. Well, it's a, it's a gradual process. Tuluski. Keep the peace and serve life.